Yo, yo, what is happening guys? This is the Don. I'm back on the video for y'all. And in today's video, I kind of have a little new type of video that I want to start doing for you guys. I'm thinking like once a week or so, I'm going to make like a live com. I'm just going to sit down. I'm going to say, all right, this is the game. And whatever happens in that game is just what happens. It doesn't have to be a nuke. It's just, I'm going to try and talk a lot so that I can get really personable with you guys. But I'm just going to talk about stuff like with Call of Duty, with life, with whatever. So I got the first of those today for you. And I just happen to have a nuke in this one. It's not something that's going to happen every single time, but I have two gameplays in this one. The first one was meh, so I did another one, but I'm going to put them together because in the first one, there were like three people in the lobby half the time. But in the second one on Solda Harbor, I ended up dropping a nuke on these kids. So I think this is a really good way to start off the series. I'm just doing this because I pretty much have done every single class setup in Modern Warfare already. And I know you guys like to see the class setups and stuff, but if you want to see any, there are all over my channel right now. Like I don't want to grind any of the shitty guns anymore, really. Just Modern Warfare 2 is coming out like pretty soon. I just kind of want to enjoy my time playing this game while it's lasting right now. Obviously, I'll still be posting tactic nukes and stuff, but I also think that I'm going to try and concentrate on some of the best gameplays, not necessarily keeping the guns varied. So like I have a ton of gameplays with the Ram. I have a ton of gameplays with the Amex. A M4, Kilo especially, the Kilo. I have literally so many with the Kilo. So I'm just going to go through those and try and find the literal best gameplays for you guys and not worry so much about like mixing up the variety of the guns. If that's something that's cool with you guys, just let me know in the comments below or say nothing at all because that's my plan right now. So if it's cool with you, say nothing and we're going to go in that direction. But in the spirit of going through and doing the class setups as we always do, I do have it right here. It's the same as it always is. There's the picture. I'm not going to spend any more time on it. As always, hope you have an absolutely fantastic rest of your day and enjoy today's gameplays. And if you're not already subscribed, make sure you hit that sub button so that you don't miss any uploads in the future, including the inevitable upcoming Model for 2 content. Let me know if you're excited for the game. Come on now. Let's just get some positivity for this thing. But enough talk from me today. Hope you guys do enjoy the gameplays as always. But for now, I'm out of here, man. Peace. You know what I want to start doing is I think once a week, I'm going to do this. I'm just going to have like a, a live commentary like yeah every like three or four videos where I, this gameplay is going to be the gameplay and there's nothing i can do about it my hands are tied so hopefully we do well if not you guys will see me in some pain and suffering i'm sure that everyone enjoys that every now and then you got to see like your favorite youtuber get shit on every now and then i feel like just to keep yourself like in a reality check this is the thing like you see all these videos and everything like I i'm sure you guys the best videos i can I don't have any, like, problem showing you guys, like, when I fail, I guess. Like, I'll, I'll leave in my deaths and stuff. Oh my goodness, there he is right there. He blended right in that little rose skin. Oh. But, like, it's really hard to find, you know, certain lobbies. Like, in Search, it probably takes, like, Devour and Handler, like, a long-ass time to get the gameplays that they make for their videos. I mean, unless they're just... I don't know, because even for them, I'm sure they're not getting 20 plus kills on fucking search matches, like, consistently. No one is. You, it's not that easy to just find that many people in the game, necessarily. Oh. Especially with the fact that some lobbies are, like, empty a lot of the time, so sometimes we'll spend time running around, like, running around the map doing a whole bunch of nothing for a while. Oh, we'll get those laggy lobbies that's been going on recently where everyone in the lobby has like 500 ping. I low-key almost dropped a nuke on one of those though because it was on shipment and actually Ryan, one of the subs here, was saying that he did the same thing with almost with Cali sticks. I was at the Origin 12 on shipment, but everyone was so laggy that no one could shoot anything. Like it didn't matter that I was lagging because no one could kill me because they didn't know where the hell I was. It was just everyone collectively was on like 500 ping. It's pretty, it's pretty insane. I want like a 26 doing that. Right yeah. What the frig? No, no, no. I'm going to kill myself. I'm going to kill myself. No, there's only three. See, this is the thing. Like, all right. Then maybe there have to be some criteria for it because I don't want it to be like a super boring game. I guess the point would be to just summarize Modern Warfare in its essence. Hmm. Now they have six. All right. That wasn't too bad. We'll just keep that all in there.
I'm going to kill myself and it's your fault. <laughs> I don't know if you guys know this, but I'll oftentimes just throw in like office references into the middle of my gameplays just because that's how my brain works. I think I've probably seen every episode of The Office like at least six times. Actually, maybe not the later seasons because that's when they really jumped the shark a bit for my, my taste, but like seasons one through the end of five, I've seen every one of those at least like six or seven times, no doubt. My teammates shooting at me. It's always fun. I didn't get both of those. That's some bullshit. I feel like I'm hearing footsteps all around my. My area. I legitimately cannot wait for Modern Warfare 2 to come out. Like, I feel like that's going to do some really big stuff for the channel. It's with everybody coming out. And everybody's going to want to, like, they're wondering about class setups. Can we talk about this for a minute? This is what Modern Warfare has become. This is what is happening to us. Sitting with a with a freaking proximity mine or bouncing bedding, whatever the hell you want to call it. In the back building. Facing the wrong direction. With a desert eagle. But yeah, I think that people come back. COD gets a good player base. This is like their last chance though. Or I, I don't want to say that because it's COD. What am I talking about? Like it's always like it's always gonna be around, but in a lot of ways, I feel like they have a huge opportunity to like reconcile right now with their player base a little bit just because like it's been three years of consistently people being upset with the games. Not just because like people love Modern Warfare, I think, like mechanically, but they hated like the commercial aspect of it. You know, so there's just, I think if they put some effort in and sacrifice a little bit of their fucking money hungriness for one game cycle, they would bring a lot of people back and it would do a lot for their like future, you know, future, uh, you know, sales and player base. That's just me. If I was like running shit over there, I would definitely be like, let's just pump the brakes on this for a second. Let's just make a like they know they can do it. Everyone knows that it's possible, you know. Run over to is set up for greatness. They just have to follow through and deliver. It would be huge. And I feel like it was different with Vanguard because people ha weren't so angry before. Like they didn't love Cold War. But people didn't hate Cold War, like, they absolutely despise Vanguard. So many people think Vanguard is legit a bit garbage, like, a piece of trash with a COD label on it. See, like, this man is weird as for that. He just sat in that little corner for so long. Certainly have this game handily won. I don't have to worry about at all. One guy on my team has more kills than me. Look how amazingly good friend it was. I'm so trash for that. <laughs> I just shot all around his like head and neck area. Sometimes when I don't play for a while, I think it's the Psychov is the one that I notice it the most with is that like my accuracy is off because if you miss any shots of the Psychov, you're it's basically ineffective considering how weak it is. 
We have like no chance to uh get this fucking guy. Am I gonna die to this? Yeah. Oh, he's literally right there. I thought that was my teammate, low key. They've only got three left. Usually, what I do in this situation is I'll just wrap the game up because I'm gonna look for a new lobby. Maybe I'll put this back to back and we'll have two because this game was kind of a little bit short and just not a ton happened. But yeah, I think I'll probably upload some stuff like this in the future. You know, just every now and then. This guy's got a shield up, like, we really have to fucking go hard for the point right now. Who knows why he could be doing that. Shit. But that guy had more fucking kills than me. He's a beast. Ooh. Did I get a kill here? Oh yeah, I guess I did. They got smoked though, they got stomped wicked hard. Nobody even close to positive. Not even remotely. I always do this in between games. If you've ever watched any of my streams, you'll see I just go through here. These numbers never change, like the KD ever, pretty much. See what it's at right now though sometimes i'll go into my phone and see how close i am to having it you know switch up to another decibel it's three six eight six zero eight one one two seven zero eight so we are at three point set two seven oh my god i can't speak two seven zero that is dead even so like as soon as it goes to three 0.265, then it goes up to 327. As soon as it goes to 3275, it will go up to 328. So we need. We're exactly even with that right now. Saldal Harbor. Good lord. Should we just run the RAM again for consistency? Yeah, I don't really want to. Sometimes I look at my classes and I'm like, oh, I don't even like any of these guns. <laughs> <laughs> because I'll be doing them for like videos like I did a video on the Valley the other day and the Graw like I like the Graw but and like the Bruin I never want to touch this again now that I got an obsidian but it, it's still here no actually I should just change this right off to uh... I actually only have two more to get for the obsidian uh, LMGs I wonder if they've nerfed the rail since they released it. I don't really remember it being nerfed, but then again, it wasn't like amazing in the first place because of how slow it was. But usually they do make guns like ridiculously overpowered for a little while just to get people to fucking buy them. I know you heard that, bro. Come on, be good. Holy Toledo. Run! Shit on. Oh! Oh my goodness! <laughs> that was nuts! Sometimes you just gotta pray the C4 detonates. This is just nothing else you can do. You're just too far committed to it. Where are they about to be at? Over in the in the back over here. Holy crap. I shouldn't sprint as much as I do, but I just get bored. See? Like that.
Dude, I cannot aim. I legitimately missed so many shots right there. I just spawned in this area. This this spawn in particular is brutal for that. Flipping randomly. Hate when it does that. No, you don't. No, you don't. Seven teammates over there. What? Last place in the world I would think I'll get shot from right here. Let's go with the popcorn. This kid's not bad. This boofed. Peek it, brother. Peek it, peek it, peek it. Yep. That's for me. I know you're here. Don't think I don't know that you're here, Mitchell. Freaking Mitch. I'm just gonna sit right here, see if anybody guesses enough. Run. Slicing and dicing. You just feel so fast when you have Denny. If I felt like this all the time, I think I'd be much more cracked out if I played on a higher RPG. I feel like I have dead silence at all times. Peek it even a little bit. I know you're down here. Is he? Yeah, there he is. Yeah, you're not doing that shit. I thought that lamp was a person. I was about to light it up. Light it up. Oh, oh. It's a NATO right there. Good lord. Sorry, brother. Saw your head. A little noggin. Over right here. Snag a quick kill. Now I'm just going to start trying to slowly peel them apart. I'm not really gonna be super aggressive. That was a really weird rotator I just took right there. All the way around the back like that. I don't normally do shit like that. I mean, I rotate around back, but that was hard as fuck. Almost got me.
Where'd everybody go? Right when the advance guy calls in, I can't get no kills. No. I got a kill for you. He killed himself. He killed himself, bro, by accident. Yo, I need three kills. There we go. For the live call, first live call of all time. This guy's just running around with a knife at this point though. Does it even count? It's just like, I'm out. Oh, he almost got me. That's the guy that killed himself with the nade. <laughs> All right, boys. First ever live com tactical nuke. I think I'm gonna do this every week. I, I I like this. It's gonna get a little bit more like realistic on the channel. You know what I'm saying? I want to show you guys the room tour too. I want to branch out from just the COD videos. I mean, Modern Warfare is wrapping up anyways. You guys know all the guns. I don't need to keep going over them, right? If you want a class setup, I have every gun in the game, basically. You got it. They're all over my channel, so. Just go check them out down there. From now on, I think I want to post, like, the best guns, like, the best gameplays that I have. Because I have literally hundreds of gameplays stored up right now that have nothing to do with, you know, a specific gun or something. Like, I have so many RAM nukes that are so good that I've been wanting to share. But I've just never... I'm not gonna... I was, haven't been posting the RAM every single day, but now, like, I don't know. Maybe I'll just put a couple good ones together and post the RAM, like, twice a week or something like that.